Good afternoon, YouTube. So I went up to Turkey Creek this morning and, and swam. I wanted to film that, but I was kind of a little short on time. I don't like rushing, so I, ha I had, had to compromise the video. But yeah, I'm here at the Gulf of Mexico today. Watercolor. I'm just going to drive my RC car around. Got my exercise, and now I'm going to have a little bit of fun, play with my toys. I gotta drive it slow to conserve the battery. Yeah, I bought this from a guy over in Panama City and had to do a little work to had to order some parts for it, but it's good now. Yeah, friend had some issues. One of the axle parts had to be replaced. Computer had to be reprogrammed. New battery, uh, a charger. There were a couple other little things I had to I had to, I had to do to it, but so far it's doing what it's supposed to do. It was four-wheel drive, but I decided to convert it over to a, a, a two-wheel drive because I have a have a, 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 a little bit more fun playing in the sand. You don't really need four-wheel drive in, in one of these things. It gets around pretty good in two-wheel drive. Hey. But yeah, we're going to be driving in people's space today, so let's see how people react. Yeah, guys, I got another series coming up on my channel where I walk into a businesses wearing my Speedo. Just figure I'd give you a heads up. Look at this thing. It's only two-wheel drive, and look at look how well it crawls in that powder. Two-wheel drive. Oh, I'm sorry. I just found the hill right here, so I have to uh, try it. Oh, yeah. It crashed. And can you believe it's only two-wheel drive? Pardon? Thank you. Yeah, I bought it on Facebook and I had to uh, put a battery in it, re fix the front end, plus the, the computer had, had to be reprogrammed and all kinds of little things, but it seems, it seems like it's good now. Oh, yeah. I know, look at that. Yep. Uh oh, tire popped off the rim. I don't know why this happens. The tire likes to pop off the rim. Yeah. Right. Probably what I need to do is get some super glue or something.
Yeah, then probably also the uh, rubbers probably age. You know, when it ages, it'll stretch. You guys from around here? No, Little Rock. Little Rock? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. About an 11 hour drive. You could just call me the local trouble, the troublemaker. Really? <laughs> yep. Well, that's good. There's nothing wrong with that. Nope. I have to go around and get mischief like driving RC cars in the beach. <laughs> Out of all the years of me going to the beach, I've never seen another RC car being driven on the beach. Never. Really? Yeah. Is, it, is this your first time coming coming down here? No, we've been down here I enjoy it here. Luckily, I only live 10 minutes down the road, so I can just get my bike, get in the truck, and drive, and just yeah. yeah. Around here, this is what I do. I go to the beach during the day, and I eat pizza for lunch, and I go tear up mud holes at night. Oh yeah, I like to get out there, get stuck, and have a jolly old time. And on top of that, I do a lot of swimming and bodybuilding, so I get, I'm pretty busy with that. Oh yeah.